Well, hey everybody and welcome back to It's Only Food with Chef John Polite. Today we are going to be showing you how to make smoked salmon deviled eggs. Cue the music. All right, well, welcome back. Thanks a lot for joining us today. If this is your first time joining us, though, please do me a favor, head down to that corner, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell so you can be notified each and every time I upload new content. All right, you clicked on this video to have me show you how to make smoked salmon deviled eggs. So let's head down here, see what our ingredients are before we start doing our prep. We are gonna start out with about nine to 10 eggs here. I've got about a half a cup of soft cream cheese, two tablespoons of sour cream, one tablespoon of lemon juice, a third of a cup of smoked salmon. We're going to cut that up. I got a tablespoon of sriracha, one teaspoon of curry powder, one teaspoon of dill, and one teaspoon of some orange peel. We got a little bit of prep to do before we put this together, so let's start doing that. All right, I want to take a bowl that's going to be big enough for all of our ingredients. That does include our eggs. So I've got some of the eggs cut already here. I am just gonna take and pop the yolk out right into our bowl. Now it's better to have more eggs than what you need. Some of these didn't peel too good, um, but we can still use the yolk. So I'm not worried about it too much because you wanna have that yolk in there for the filling. So if the outside of the egg doesn't really work out too well, that's not a big deal as long as you can get some useful yolk out of it you're good to go now this was a requested video from a, a viewer that I have his name's John Hamilton he's out of Yorktown Virginia so he requested to see me do smoked salmon deviled eggs so this one's for John out there in Virginia now I'm just gonna keep doing these eggs here see I cut that one screwed up I can still use the yolk. Make sure that yolk gets in there. I'm gonna leave a card right here on how to cook hard cooked eggs. Feel free to look at that when you have some time. But I'm gonna continue getting all these yolks out of here. And we'll transition into the next part. Now I did get some collateral damage, as you can see on the egg whites there. But that's all right, because I do have plenty right here. And I've got plenty of yolk to make our stuffing or filling for our eggs. These are actually on a plate that we're just gonna to use to stage. When we go ahead and start filling them, I'm gonna put them onto a different plate for presentation. But let's go ahead and start adding our ingredients into the mixture. I'm gonna go with about a tablespoon with the lemon juice. I'm gonna go ahead and add our mayonnaise right on in there. Our orange peel, our dill, our curry, and the sriracha. Now I'm going to go ahead and mash all this up before I add the cream cheese. If that cream cheese is not hard enough, I'm sorry, let me get this. If that cream cheese is still kind of hard. It's going to be really hard to blend and fold into this, so that's why I did that. I want to make sure all these yolks are broken up so they mix well. And that way if that cream cheese is still kind of hard, it will blend easier and we won't have a bunch of lumps. So get that out of there. Go ahead and add our cream cheese right in there. And if you get a blender, you can do this in a blender as well. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stir all that up. And I'm gonna do our, I'm getting a lot of mess here. I'm gonna do the salmon last because I didn't wanna dice it up and throw it in here and then keep mixing this up because it would just macerate the salmon even more. And I wanna keep that with as much integrity as I can on the cuts that I do with it. So this is blending rather well. I'm gonna hit it with some salt and pepper. 
got a nice color to it. It's spreadable. So. Alright, I'm going to set that aside. Salmon right here. And basically, all I'm going to do is give it a nice little dice. And we're going to add that right into the egg mixture. Alright, got our salmon in there. We're just going to go ahead and mix this all up. All right, now you can, if you want to, rinse out all the egg so it's not on the outside as well. But I'm just going to take our filling and I'm just going to put it right in there until it's as full as I want it. If you have a bag, you can pipe this in there if you want to. I don't have one. I'm not going to make one with a plastic bag either. And you just keep doing this until you get a plate full which is what we're going to do right now. I am going to finish this up, dress it up, make it look real pretty, take off some photos of it for social media. We're going to lay that into the timeline with some groovy music, and then we're going to come back and we're going to try these out. So enjoy the pictures and enjoy the music. and a lot of the, the egg white uh, left over too. When you're plating, put a little bit of yolk down on where you want to put the egg and then it will keep it from falling over or sliding around. It'll hold it firmly in place. You can see here, I'm not having a lot of problem with that. A little trip tip I, I learned years ago. Also, if you're doing a large number of people at a party and you've got other things on the menu, best thing to do is get this stuff made up ahead of time and get yourself an assistant to help put these together. They're not that hard to fill and plate. Um, just show them how you want one done and let them go for it. Because you got a lot of other stuff you gotta worry about if you're catering or doing a party. Because um, you gotta be all the details you gotta worry about. Anyway, here's our finished product. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a taste. Just find one here. So, there it is again. Too pretty to eat. That curry is is reigning supreme in that bite. You can taste the, the fishiness of the salmon, the smoked, the wood smoke of it in there. Um, the creaminess, of course, with that cream cheese in there and the mayonnaise. Or sour cream, I'm sorry. Sour cream. i have to get another bite. <laughs> it's really, really good. Textures are fine. The uh, smoked salmon doesn't add any chewiness to it. It's just smooth in there as well. Mmm. These are really, really good. I like deviled eggs anyway. Thousands of different ways to do deviled eggs. This is just one of them, as per the request from John Hamilton out there in Virginia. I appreciate you watching. Thanks a lot. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't done so already. Make sure you leave a comment down below. Make sure you like the video. Check out the groovy links down below and then share this video with everyone. Everyone that you know. Thanks a lot for the request, John. I appreciate it. We'll see you again next time right here on It's Only Food with Chef John Pleat. Bye-bye.